welcome back to my channel. My name is Anna and her name is Lani. Leilani. And uh, my channel contains uh, clean with me, shop with me, organize with me, decorate with me, DIYs. And if you're interested in those type of uh, channels, please consider subscribing to my channel. I would love to have you part of our family. And today we are gonna clean Hope this video helps you, motivates you, inspires you to get up and clean your house, or even it distracts you in any way. I hope this helps you. Um, thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoy it, and let's start cleaning. All right? Ow. All right. And yes, I do have a full face of makeup. Uh, the reason is I just recorded the Amazon um haul amazon and walmart haul um i'll link it down below and so i decided to you know get ready and stuff so yeah i am cleaning as well so tackling two videos in one uh all i did is i changed my shirt and that is it right so let's get ready to clean so let's start with cleaning the kitchen, getting everything where it's supposed to go. Um, I will say this was the first week or the first day my husband went back to work. So it was kind of weird because I he stayed with me for two weeks. And so I will tell you it was a little different. Um, and we actually did bake bread. And you'll, I'm showing it to you right now. It came out really, really good. If you guys want to see the recipe of it, I could um, maybe bake it again in one of my videos. It was so good. We finished every single one of them. And yeah, I really recommend the recipe. And like I said, I'll do it in another video. That way um, you guys can see how, how uh, I made it. I've never done bread before and so we just decided because it was both of us so it was fun to do. The further we move on from all those yesterdays, happiness gets nearer. The light that we see closing in so fast ahead It's hope, it's getting clearer The more I think of all the tough times we survived The more it makes me smile If nothing's broken us, yeah, nothing ever will Cause dreams are hard to kill
through it all with you by my side if you're in meet me here tonight be brave and come along i'll be your right promise we don't need no break lights we can travel the world so just say yes choose to do whatever comes next to keep your kitchen drawers organized every time you put uh, a, like for example a spice away or silverware away just organize it that way um, it's always organized and uh, you don't wait until like it's such a mess that you need to redo it again so that is what I like to do in my kitchen and also I like to change out um, decoration just because it bores me a little bit and that is what I'm doing now I felt like adding another like coffee maker in this section was a little bit too much. There was a lot going on here. So I decided to take my my tear tray that I created um, out of the picture. I just stored it somewhere. That way I can use it another time. And it kind of made the space a little bit less messy. Um, so that is what I'm doing. And here you see me with my planner again. Every morning I actually uh, write down everything that I want to do for the day that way it keeps me busy and I know exactly what I need to do that way I'm not stressing out or I'm not forgetting to do something so I really recommend you writing you know what you want to do for each day and um, that way you can it's so much fun actually crossing things out of your uh, list and knowing that you did something because Staying home can make you feel like if you haven't achieved anything the whole day and having a list and crossing it out, it's such a great feeling and I really recommend you and that will keep you motivated and it will keep you in track of everything that you want to do. Um, so that way you don't forget something and if you do, it's okay. You could do it the next day. Nothing's wrong with leaving things until the next day. Um, and it, I know it's hard being at home and I'm telling you because I am a stay at home mom. So to me, um, being in the situation that we are now, I actually haven't felt so much of a difference other than my husband being with us for two weeks and also the stores being closed. So those are the only two um, reasons I felt like this situation has affected me. But honestly, I always stay home I don't go out and so it hasn't changed my life too much but the fact that I you know I had my my husband with us for two weeks that kind of like was different for us but it was a good thing because we do need you know spend time together and um he kind of knew how it was for me to stay home and not being able to go out so it was a good experience for him to know um, what it is to stay home and so you know now he understands me <laughs> a little bit more because that way um, he knows that sometimes it's a bad day and sometimes it's a good day and uh, so I hope uh, 
this is helping everyone staying safe. <laughs>
So that is what I'm doing now. I'm just switching the sheets. And then I'm going to fix the curtain because it was driving me crazy that I hadn't done it. And this room, like I said, my husband uses to store all of his work uh, clothes because in the mornings he leaves so early that he changes here and, you know, gets ready here. That way he doesn't wake us up. And so that is what I'm doing now. I want to get it ready, fixed. Um, I don't know when, how long it's going to take for somebody to come and sleep on uh, and be our guest. But I just wanted to get this room uh, nice and ready and uh, clean because, yeah, we don't use it. And it's always so messy because my husband uses it. So I need to keep uh, keep up with this room as well. you're putting in all your hopes and efforts are all in vain who will pick you up when you've lost everything does it all and now let's tackle the guest uh restroom and like i said my husband uses this restroom as well to, you know, go to the restroom, shower. I bathe my daughter in this restroom, as you can tell, with all her toys. And so I wanted to really clean this restroom and detail it. Um, and as you can see, I tried to do it uh, a week ago. And I wanted to do like a little trick. Um, but my daughter wanted to go eat, so I had to stop doing that. And so I totally forgot, you know, the day went by and I totally forgot that I was doing it. So I am finally going to finish it, see how it looks. And, um, I actually do this at least once a month where I take everything out of the tub and I really, really deep clean the, the tub because like I said, my daughter, uh, baths here and my my husband showers in this one so I want to clean it as much as I can uh, usually I just you know spray it and then just wipe it down or with hot water but once a month I like to scrub it with this scrub uh, with this brush that I'm going to use right now because that way I know for a fact it's cleaning it really really well and so that is what I'm going to do today for granted with a wedding ring oh there must be more there must be another way there must be conscious different things in different ways there must be love there must be a reason and a little bit of faith has got to come I have here I felt like the brown light brown was a little too like just simple so I had this extra um, shower curtain in my storage and I was like why don't I just you know do a little trick um, I say Mickey Mouse it because you know I just wanted different curtains but I don't want to go out and buy some obviously because I can't go out and so all I did was I pin it to the other curtain and I put pins in these pins. I actually got a Dollar Tree 
and you know what i actually love how it looks i know like from far away it looks really really pretty um you know but once you get close you could tell that i did something to it and it doesn't belong there but you know what i just kind of want to change things out um and make it different even if it if i haven't done much that way i feel like i did something with the place or with the area 